This is Ash News TV, and I've got the honor now of being joined by Dr. Robert Negrin, who is the founding editor for uh, Blood Advances Journal. Dr. Negrin, thank you so much for uh, coming by and joining us and telling us a little bit about this very unique and very special publication. Well, thank you very much for the opportunity. So we're excited to launch uh, the new journal uh, published by American Society of Hematology called Blood Advances. This is an online peer-reviewed journal that uh, the only published uh, version will be here at ASH, and the rest of the, uh, the publications will be online. It's an open access journal, and we hope to reach a, a broad worldwide audience with this new journal. Content, always important. Give us some ideas of what we can expect. So the content area will uh, uh, span the, the broad range of hemologic disciplines, and we hope to uh, be able to also bring in uh, many contributions from around the world, including some contributions from uh, less developed uh, parts of the world where hemologic disease is certainly rampant and uh, practitioners need to uh, to be able to uh, learn more about what's going on in the world uh, and to advance their uh, professional capabilities. We also hope to uh, sponsor a number of what we call Blood Advances Talks or BATS and these will be short uh, talk uh, reviews on an interesting topic that can be uh, listened in audio format anywhere, anytime uh, and, and uh, hope to reach a very broad audience with this type of capability. With advances changing so rapidly, does this give you a lot of flexibility to be able to get information out uh, very quickly to uh, uh, ASH membership and, and others who might be able to uh, sign up? Absolutely. I think one of the things that's stunning is the, the pace of change in our world and an online publication gives us enormous flexibility with respect to uh, what we can do, how, how broadly we can uh, distribute our information, and some of the different concepts that we can use, including advanced graphics and uh, video and audio uh, formats that uh, enable us to uh, really enhance the opportunities to communicate with our uh, community of hematologists. Now, do you seek submissions as well, or do you have a staff that uh, goes out and seeks the news? Obviously? Oh, no, absolutely. We seek submissions. We welcome uh, uh, contributions to, the, to our journal. It goes through rigorous peer review, uh, similar to other um, uh, very important, and prestigious, and high impact journals. And we hope to uh, be able to publish uh, the very best uh, new information. Uh, we hope also that Blood Advances will also capture things that might be uh, a little bit more uh, early phase, if you will, and perhaps not uh, as well established as, as uh, some of uh, the material that goes into uh, perhaps blood. And manuscripts can come to Blood Advances in several different ways. We certainly welcome uh, new submissions to the journal. They can also come as uh, recommendations from blood, sort of paper go to blood and not uh, reach the lofty standards of uh, acceptance of blood. That paper can be recommended to uh, come to blood advances or the authors can opt in, meaning that their paper would automatically come to us for evaluation. And to give us an idea, there's a great deal of uh, publicity, if you will, uh, you're seeing on the pedicabs uh, hauling folks around as well as some of the signage that's around the convention center. Obviously, this, there's a big push because there's a big need for this type of information and making it so readily available. It is a free publication. That's right. It's a free online open access journal, which is uh, a new concept for the American Society of Hematology. This is the first peer review journal in the last 70 years to be published by the American Society of Hematology, so we think it's a big moment and we're really excited to promote it in any way possible. So the hard copy one time only here at the ASH annual meeting and beyond that online. That's correct. This is the only uh, printed version. Uh, the the uh, subsequent uh, issues of the journal will be online uh, uh, only and we hope that people will visit our website and also the uh, online app uh, to be able to access content. Doctor, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you very much for the opportunity. This is ASH News TV.